Good morning and welcome to the Montenegro vlog 2017 season 2 episode 4 I'm out of breath um, if you go back in the uh, vlogs to maybe 2014 maybe or well, you can just search uh, you'll see that I came here and climbed to the castle of San Giovanni um, which overlooks Goto, which is there. And you must probably remember that I was tremendously out of breath, a little bit like I am today, um, still, but older, so give me that, and a very wackily, uh, shaky camera, because I was out of breath, and <laughs> I was just wrong. But you like the video anyway. This time I've got a stabilizer, so hopefully it's a bit better. So I got up this morning and uh, my vibra stopped working, so I couldn't contact Philomena, who's the vice president of the Belgrade Visits Club, and I think she wanted to come on this climb this morning. So I've had to start without her. Tam is um, uh, back in Perchan. So I've got to the first, I would say stop the first vantage point with the camera, with this rather old chapel. Uh, I'm going to once again show you some super views from over Kotor and the history to San Giovanni I'll put in the description below but I'm perspiring I don't know what the time is but it's uh, well before half past seven I might have said this last time so at the risk of repeating myself for the uh, fraternity the lights running through the woods it's on on Well, some of the stairs are in reasonable repair and then you come around to this where they've all sort of well it's just rubble basically but there we go I don't know how many hundred stairs there are but we'll get there I think I'm three quarters of the way. Another love hate affair with stairs. Starting to hate stairs very much. There it is. So close, but yet so far away. That flagpole with the flag of Montenegro on is the target. And looks like some of the grass fires sort of like found their way up this far. How sad. So I take it, this is the guardroom to the keep. I don't know what this area here would have been for. Obviously the wall's broken, but what a view. You could never attack this and defeat it. Unless you had serious, a serious siege. But I think there's so many tunnels and ways out, it would have been impossible. I don't know, I'd have to read the history books. Seven fifty, and I made it. So I reckon we stopped to do some filming and take some shots and do a Facebook live. Another one coming, actually. Um, maybe fifty minutes. At the same time as last, the last time I did it. 
or the same duration. You don't want to be my t-shirt. It's like a towel. I'm just admiring this amazing view from up here. Definitely worth it. So if you come to KOTOR, uh, do it early in the morning so you avoid the heat. Uh, I would say any age can do it. You just have to take, take your time, get in a rhythm. Mine was 25 paces, stop for 30 seconds. 25 paces, stop for 30 seconds. Be polite to everybody, say hi, meet some really cool people. The Australian, one of the ladies wasn't American, she was Australian, but uh, that was really cool. And uh, yeah, I've done it again. And I'm older. God, but the view is worth it. Oh, and if you do come early, I don't believe you have to pay the entrance. So I mentioned earlier on that uh, Philomena, I might not see her, and she turned up on top here. Fresh as a daisy, typical. <laughs> so not fresh. You know, you come from New South Wales. Is there lots of... Sorry, I'm fresh. I'm fresh. <laughs> <laughs> even fresher than I am. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we're, this is, this is, we got to the top of the, the castle club. Um, you know is there a bit of kangaroo in you because you're, like, jumping about everywhere? And I mean, you, you didn't break into a... Um, you didn't break into a glow, did you? I did, the, I did this, the perspiring down there actually and then waited until I got up here it's nice it's, not, it's nice when you get up here isn't it <laughs> it's beautiful it's not very, very pleasant when you're doing it. it uh do you know well no it's beautiful I mean I don't know if you, if you yeah Let's have a look. It's, it's stunning actually probably maybe if we do it a little bit a few steps down below that concrete block but it's beautiful it is stunning it I is suffer stunning. I suffer with such vertigo do you uh, some of the parts coming up there I went I got rather I got <laughs> I got rather weak about it. No, I do, but not here. No, it's too. I think I'm just too busy looking out and not down that I, I'm not worried by it. Mm. Shall we go and do that coffee now? Let's do the coffee. Yep, Tam, we're coming. We're coming. <laughs> <laughs> you ran up here last year. I ran up here last year for pleasure. Well, I was actually, I was rushing. I had to be somewhere at a certain time. Uh -huh. And I had asked someone just down at the bottom, oh, if you come up, handy hint to everyone, if you come up before 8 or 9 a.m., you don't have to pay. It's free. Because I think Mugs Montenegro here, and they open the three... You know, you have to pay three euros to come she up. She comes from a G5 country, <laughs> the five most richest in the world, and she skinnies it on, on the entrance. Where, 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 where do I live? I live in Serbia. Oh. Yeah, it's an average salary of you get away with euros. It. Thank you, which is <laughs> some very large percentage of euros. Um, so I ran up here, yeah, in Serbia. So it's a few hours later and um, we've had coffee. Philomena's gone off to do her thing. I'm gonna catch up again. We had a good chat about bits and pieces, but uh, I've dried out. I arrived for coffee, um, drenched, totally drenched, but um, yeah, I'm dry now. And back to Perch. And I had thought actually of coming straight down, having a quick coffee and jumping in the car and going back but you know how it goes get talking with people and me one of my faults is I talk for the world so back to the car and back home I actually do feel quite good although bones are aching and I hope you enjoyed the Facebook um, lives if you were checking them out and I don't know if I can do this but uh, I'll see if I can put some clips at the end of this vlog uh, from those if I can download those Facebook lives. So yeah, that's it from climbing the castle. Um, if you like to share and comment and like, that'd be greatly appreciated.
and I'll catch you for episode 5 of the Montenegro vlog 2017 season 2 tomorrow. I've just climbed up there. Can you believe it? <laughs>